You can't have lost another one. Did you search your room? Did I search my room? I left the party early, spontaneously got home right when my mom did, told her I was organizing our shoe closet while frantically looking for it. Yes, I searched my room. <sighs> Changed my mind. Lasagna's the best leftovers. And pad thai. And what's wrong? Who flunked what? Simone lost her key again. What? How many times is that now? Five this semester. My parents were livid last time. Now my life's over. Finished. Agreed. You're toast. Unless... Jackson? You're brilliant. I know, but you can keep saying it. Why do I have a 3D printer if not to break into my own house? I'll scan my mom's key, sneak it back downstairs, and then, oh, this says I need to print a decoder first. Boring. Call me one of Simona's super spy time again, okay? No, stay. It can be our first all night hangout. Super fun, right? I'm gonna go floss just in case sleep winds up being more fun than our all night hangout. Done. These numbers correspond with printer software templates. See? There's key formats? Someone loses as many keys as you do. Now what? Truth or dare? Gossip? Sleep. Night, you guys. Looks like it's you and me, Bev, on the night shift, getting stuff done. Do you always stay up this late? Yeah. Midnight snack? Cereal. Great idea. Cereal? Yuck. These are beets. You can't even tell the difference. Nice. Did you test it? Going down to do that right now. You know, I thought I'd feel more sleepy, but... Oh no. Why? What am I gonna do? Shh, Simone, I'm sleeping. Simone, I'm leaving. Lock the door. For sure, Mom. Right? For sure? Well, this printer is better than yours, so the key should be stronger. So, how much longer? Any chance I can make it to bio and lock my house? Three minutes plus nine to run to your bedroom window. What if you sprint? Seven? Forget it. I'm in. Thanks, BFF. Oh, good. You're here. Okay. Oh, thanks, Lana. You're the greatest. How can I? Did your mom leave? Oh, she left five minutes ago. Why did I just climb through your bedroom window? Let's go. Oh, what if it doesn't work? Should we just climb through my bedroom window? Simone, use the key. Okay, so bad news, someone did break into my game. I knew I didn't build that rock climbing wall. The good news is everything I own is re-password protected. No one's getting into my game anymore anyway. Are you done cleaning your room? Okay, clearly not. Yeah, done might be optimistic. So we're not going to a movie? No, let's. Uh, give me half an hour? Ugh, I guess I'll just do the yoga chain homework. Again. Yoga chain homework, I forgot. Uh, I'll just do two workouts tomorrow. As if Miss Ginsburg gets her stats sent to her. She'll mark you down if you break the chain. The whole point of a yoga chain is not to break it, right? Okay, let me go focus. Half an hour, I promise I'll be ready. Namaste. Begin with deep breaths. Center yourself. Let your mind relax. Let your concerns fall away. Yeah, right. You don't have a movie to get to. Fold your back half toward the sky. <sighs> Entering a giving, Engineering generous hack downward. Coming up. Flow forward into upward-facing dog. Okay. 
step or jump to the front of your mat. Find your way to a swaying tree. Seven, are you seeing this? This is the best yoga hack ever. Slowly arch backward, allowing your body to find the sun in all its glory. Giving new meaning to power yoga. Bring your hands to heart center. Bring your left leg back and allow your body to find the balance of a beautiful triangle. Uh, whoa! Ow! Ow! Bevan? Bevan? Mom? Feel calm energy flowing through your body. Take the time you need. Check me move at your own pace. Check me move at your own pace. Check me move at your own pace. Check me. Oh, there you are. Oh, your poor wrist. Was the movie at least terrible? Well, it was terrible, but that's what made it awesome. So I think the right thing to say is, sorry you missed it. Hey, are you okay? Your brace isn't as bad as you said. How long do you have to wear it for? Three weeks. If you do your exercises, young lady. Oh, right. When I broke my wrist and I came out the cast, it was all skinny and gross. Do those exercises, Simone. It's sprained, but thanks. What are the different colors for? I get it. Different colors for as you get stronger. <laughs> I guess. I haven't tried and I know I should, but it hurts and it's boring. You know what you need? Motivation. Hang on a minute. How long do you think she means? The kids our age know who L. Frank Baum is? You know, tornadoes, witches, yellow oh. bricks? He wrote The Wizard of Oz. L-F-R-A-N-K. Six letters. Open menu. Uh, select object. Shape. Oval. Ta-da! I present your motivation. Go for it. <laughs> Try them all out. How'd you do this? You made this into like your dream toy. I call it gamification. Makes boring stuff fun. First I connected the keys to the notes and then I randomized the dots. That is so cool. Uh, what are these other dots here? Uh-huh. You play those notes with the higher level grips. Motivation. You're such a strange person. You know that, right? Oh, and my motivation. Oh, Simone, those are unreal. Ooh. Not bad, huh? I should totally insta these. Yeah, you should. Whoa, apparently a lot of people like these. A lot. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Nothing. I'm just nervous. You look like you're a supply teacher. I'm dressing like a leader. When the 2067 Expo team gets here, I'll seem, you know, in charge. Yeah, who says? All the search engine auto-completes when you type in, leaders should wear. I have so many questions about your life. For Oh, you all came together. Yeah, our lockers are in the same hall, so... Is that a problem? Okay, so it's amazing that we can all do 2067 Expo together. You may or may not know, but on the day, we'll have two hours to complete a super fun tech project from scratch to show what we think stuff will be like in 50 years, right? Right. Thanks, Lana, my right hand. You sent in a bunch of great ideas, which gave us a lot of great ideas. Neil just emailed in one more, so I will forward that to you. Thanks. I know Principal Ravelli really wants us to work on super fun kids in the real world ideas, so I think we should develop this. What is it, a flashlight? So you know how people have already figured out hand-powered flashlights? I was thinking we could put these tiles that conduct electricity to the bulb into a 3D printed housing we will design. So it's a flashlight? Yep. 
But since your palm needs to touch these tiles, which conduct energy from your hand, 3D printing the housing will let us customize the design. So it's ergonomic, useful, environmentally friendly. What's not to love? And what am I missing? Maybe it just feels a bit safe? Like Flashlights have already been invented. I was thinking that we could work on how gaming and apps can be useful. We use them all the time, so how will we use them in the future? Like the one that I use for your wrist? But if we're talking future sustaining energy, all that important stuff, I think we should go flashlight. But if Ravelli wants super new, fun, kids in the real world stuff, I think gaming's a no-brainer, right? But our goal is to win the expo, so I think we need something that is kind of a brainer, don't you think? Guess we need a little more time. Yeah. You guys can go. We'll update you before the next meeting. One of us will send you an email telling you what our direction is. It'll be me. I'll send it. <laughs>